Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. Covering Costa Mesa, Pasadena, Camarillo, and all of Southern California, this is Eyewitness News. Fisher Earth Day falls on Sunday, April 22nd, but many eco-friendly people would like it if we were environmentally friendly each and every day. New at 5, Eyewitness News reporter Lori Corbin found companies that are creating places and products to do just that. We're a part of a huge movement of um, owners of businesses and product manufacturers who are trying to reuse and recycle products and reduce waste. At Tost in downtown LA, Christy Hogan's staff is getting ready for lunch rush eco-friendly style. If you were sitting in a Tost restaurant on one of our chairs holding a bowl of salad, you would be sitting on 111 recycled Coke bottles and you'd be holding in your hand three recycled water bottles. Even the tables and decor are paper-based, which she spent more on, but feels it's worth it. Long term, it's not sustainable mm -hmm. to create that much trash, and it'll always cost more to um, find a place to move the trash to and to keep it and to wait for it to decompose. We are a green company that uh, makes, plant, makes cups from plants, not petroleum, and um, all our cups are 100% compostable, eco-friendly, and um, best of all, affordable. Coffee houses take note. Repurposed hot cups have the thickness of two cups and a sleeve yet will break down in a compost in 90 days. A box of 24 costs five bucks and you can find them in stores like Gelson's, Bed Bath & Beyond at Amazon. Zoroka says when you use their carbon neutral cookware with recycled steel and bamboo handles, you're feeding your family by saving the earth. While snap sack reusable bags go beyond the grocery with bags for things like lunch, grocery, the gym, even one for garments. They range from 350 to 750 for bags that fold and snap shut. And how about getting fit while saving the planet with Brooks Green Silent Shoe? 75% of this shoe is made from recycled material. But beyond buying anything, one of the best things you can do is serve and eat proper portions. That's because the Natural Resources Defense Council says the average American throws away 33 pounds of food in a month. That's like throwing 40 bucks in the trash. Lori Corbin, ABC7 Eyewitness News.